So I got this limestone that's popping out whenever we get a cold weather and the pieces of rock are just popping right out of the patio. So I'm going to try some of this superior gold epoxy, which has a hardener and um, see if I can get some of these pieces put back into the deck. So that's what a fresh can looks like. I've seen this stuff before and it looks more yellow. So they only use 1% of this hardener, which is just not much. And it says you have about six minutes. should cure in, in just 20 minutes. All right, let's go do some more. Got this base of this bird bath that broke from the freeze as well, and uh, I'm gonna use this epoxy on here too.
All right, well, let's let that cure and we'll see how it does. So this is the first one I glued up and it's been about just not even 10 minutes. And uh, yeah, that stuff's set up hard. It's not, I mean, you don't feel any movement. So I'm just gonna fill in. I don't know how this stuff reacts with the sun. I don't want it to turn yellow or some weird thing. So I'm gonna leave that gap and then I'm gonna fill that in with some sand colored caulking some sand uh, textured caulking that you use for caulking where you have missing tile grout. And I'll just use a, a white uh, color in there and it'll blend right in with the rest of this travertine. Here's that caulking that is actually like a sanded grout and it has different colors and you can use it to fill in gaps like this and it looks just like you grouted it. Got the grout in there, uh, epoxy's all cured, and it uh, looks great. Now all the grout has dried, and uh, you can see how it came out um, with the two pieces that we epoxied back in, and, and then applied that uh, caulking grout uh, that blends in really good with this travertine. You can hardly tell, but these were two, two popped out busted pieces from the freeze. Uh, this Superior Gold, I've seen them use it on granite countertops and works really well and it looks like it'll be useful for patching up a lot of different things around here.